welcome back to the Hilly Homestead where, well, whew, we lost a few of our team earlier on I'm very very disappointed with that but what can you do? Well, all we can do is try and get back up to strength uh, we have bed spaces for two, four, six, eight, nine peeps. Um, we did have ten before, but because Kyle was in a relationship with Drang, but Drang unfortunately got shot on the last uh, offensive mission we did, uh, which is a real shame. So um, yeah, oh dear. But we have just recruited Kaiten, Kylan, Kalem. Yeah, something like that. Um, and we're a little, we're we're low on fuel and stuff because we've been out selling loads of loads of stuff and out on these missions. So um, we are low on food now. The crops have been planted, and it looks like these mushrooms have been planted as well, which is good. Yeah, and that's definitely helped the light situation in there, at least visually. Um, so we'll wait for these crops to grow, we'll clear out all these construction tasks and then after that we'll be able to do a bit of a stock take and, uh, and hopefully go out and do some more offensive missions. Um, so we've got an auto door there, I'm going to want another one onto the grain store which is going to be here once we've got the last couple of bits done. So one sand's going to go and have some food, yes, that sounds sensible. And then I want you to come and work on that, and then work on that. And then we can get this stockpile zone going. Okay. So how are we finding this series? That's the first time I've done a, a series per se. Um, obviously taking my inspiration from uh, the wonderful Quill18, fantastic streamer. If you've not uh, seen his stuff before, I do implore you to go and check it out because uh, his content's great and it's uh, it's him and Chewy94 really who've got me into streaming and uh, and YouTubing and stuff. I don't do it for money. I mean, I don't have enough viewers and subs and stuff like that to get money out of this. I'm doing it purely for my uh, own enjoyment and hopefully yours as well. Um, so, we're going to go important priority, raw resources, plant matter. Uh, no, we're not. We're going to do raw food, vegetarian. So grains, barley, although we're not growing any corn. Um, what else was that? There? there was something else we were doing. Bar uh, corn. Oh, wheat, wasn't it? Wheat. Yeah, there we go. So we now have a store for that, which means we can take wheat off there. Uh, yeah. Yeah, and then any surplus will go into the freezer. But it will prefer to go in here. Good. So I'm debating whether we need a cooler here. We'll see what it's like once all the doors are built, whether these internal corridors and stuff actually cool down. Just with leakage from our other coolers. Ooh, sorry, that might have got a bit loud. I was just moving something around. Um, so yeah, we'll, we'll play that one by ear, I think. Golly's on a minor break risk, but you're asleep. Okay. Mm. 
and we've got ourselves a raid. So, first things first, recall all our bots. Prepare for a while, then tack. Very advanced. Okay, where are they? They're up here. What sort of guns have we got? Oh, we have got a gun. Machine pistol. Auto pistol. Auto pistol. Revolver. And a mace. Nothing to overly worry me, actually. All our guys are tooled up. Yeah, they are, with some pretty decent uh, firepower, actually. I'm going to restrict everyone in so they don't go out and miss them. All our traps are armed. And actually, there's one more thing I'm going to put in here I've just thought of, which is salt. Yeah. Cotton doesn't deteriorate, no, that's fine. And they're beginning their assault, so recruit all into your positions, boys and girls. You can come up there. And they are fleeing. And the other dude's gone. So, we want to finish you off. You're already finished off. Unrecruit all. Bots can go out to help with the hauling. And that was a, uh, a great success, I would say. Unrestrict peeps. We need some of this slate to come in. Tempted to put an urgent haul on it, but that does slow us down on everything else. So maybe that's not a good idea. Although well, we have got the space for it now. That's all granite. I'll tell you what, I'm going to put an urgent haul on just these ones. And then a normal haul on those. And then at least we've got the stuff in the stockpile so we can start making these slate blocks because that's what we're going to need to finish off a load of these floors, the auto doors. Wow, that blue floor looks amazing. Really like the look of that. Yeah, it looks great. So it's the hole in the slate. That's good. That's going up to our dumping stockpile up there. So how's our work looking? So we've got no one who's really prioritised on handling. We've got a few priorities on cooking, negotiate, not hunting, I'm not too bothered about that. Constructing's fine, growing's fine, mining, not too bothered about that. Plank cutting is not great, but okay for now. Smithing, we haven't really got anyone on. So I'm going to put you on a three there. That's golly, isn't it? Yeah. Tailoring, no one particularly on. Art, not overly bothered about that just now. Crafting. Hauling, no one particularly on cleaning duties either. So who can I stick on cleaning as a higher priority? I think possibly Timo. Cleaning 
because the place is looking a little bit bloody everywhere, isn't it? And Rusty is throwing a party, celebrate your new spine. And we've got a textiles trade ship, which we will give a shout. We've not hauled any of that, so we might not be able to do a great deal with it. Uh, but we can get rid of that, that, that. Uh, looking for anything that's uh, from a dead man or is degraded or isn't of uh, normal quality or better it's degraded Paddy Hat Chef's Hat would be good I think they do give a bit of a buff I can't remember oh, well, well we'll get them anyway see what happens um, Surgeon's apron would be nice. Again, don't know if it gets us a buff. Yeah, it does. Medical quality. Chefing. What does the chefing one get us? Cooking speed increase and a reduction in food poisoning chance. So that's worth having. So I think that'll do. It costs us a few quid, but uh, that's okay. So I'd imagine Shah and Kyle are going to put the chef's hats on, but we'll, we'll wait and see on that. I'm coming into the stockpile now. So two good chef's hats. We have a mad animal. Already marked for hunting. You're loaded with a LMG. Let's see where it went. Where did it go? Oh, it's there. Oh, it's going at the box. Box back in. Recall all. Golly, you can stay asleep, as can Shah. Hopefully that's not annihilated our bot. No, it hasn't. Well, it looks like it's seen better days. Carl's on a sad wander. Yeah, sorry mate, you lost your wife. And, uh, I can't do anything to help you, bud. I really can't. Not a lot I can do, but sit, you know, wait for him to sit it out. It's a real shame. Real. Oh well. So, Golly's up now. You're filling barrel. No, I'm going to get you to do stone cutting. This is low priority. That's normal. I'm going to put that. I'm going to risk it and put that up to normal. So at least the stuff's a little bit closer in. So bots are back out. No wind at the moment, but it's alright. We're good on power. We're really good on power actually. 
Kyle's on a major break risk. That'll help. I need some sweets. Oh no, you're asleep now. Oh, and we got another raid. Wild rats, they're not happy that we've taken out a load of their faction. <laughs> So you guys like that box recall all So, we'll unrestrict everything and unrecruit. So, we've got some more corpses to deal with. So, we'll get some cremating going. And whoever comes and turns that on, uh, activate all the bots again. No power. Why have we got no power? Oh. Did I turn it off? You moron. So come and do this cremating. New lovers, Kaylin and Shah. Kaylin, female 32, and Shah, male 34. And they've gone and got their own beds, which is nice. So they're, they're sleeping there. And there we go. Got a lot of apparel there. I like how it just sort of spams it outside the walls, that's quite funny. So, no one's put the chef's hats on, so that was a monumental waste of money. No one's put the shoulder pads on. What were the other things we bought? Hemp headset. Hmm. Oh well. It's the thought that counts, that's what they always tell me. So filling up the barrels, we've got some more booze coming in. Exotic goods trader coming in, that's good. Ah, so... Who needs stuff? You need a new torso and a thumb. It's also thumb and eye. You need new lungs. Okay. Are they going to come into the base this time? No, are they? Heck. Let's try and catch them before they go too far away. It's also thumb, eye, and lungs. That's what we need to remember. Uh, none of those help. Brilliant. Um, okay. Yeah, our base station don't need that cleaner base station might be nice. Gold would be good. 
Um, so if we get the cleaner base station, sell our sweets. That makes a good dent in that. Hyperweave, we just don't seem to be using it, so we'll get rid of that. We'll round that off to 700. And it costs us 120. But a male and female cobra. Oh, I do want them. We can breed cobras. Yes. That sounds very good in DD. Uh, now, where do I want this cleaner? Why won't it go there? What's in there? Don't know. Cleaner bot will therefore go. You want him out of the way? You can go up there. So one Sam, prioritise that, will ya? And then, right, okay, so manager, cobras. Don't want to butcher excess. Do want to train for obedience, not well drafted. Restrict animals to the animal area. Awesome. Oh, that's really cool. We've got cobras. It's like a verring again. There they are, there they come. Hey! And the cleaner bot's out. That's really useful because the cleaning has been pretty poor since we lost our dudes. Um, that's one of the things we took a hit on. And the cleaner bot is, oh, it's like the Scutters, isn't it, from uh, Red Dwarf. So he's going around, yeah, he's really absolutely smashing through this. That's massively going to help with the beautification and cheering people up. Look at him go, absolutely tearing up. Uh, so, robots... Wait a minute... Oh, hang on, have I just cleared the animal area by mistake? Oh, you plonker. Animal area one. Let's try that again. So we're gonna have to go through all this again, aren't we? Oh you absolute doofus. Uh, unrestricted, unless that. These guys stay home. Thrumbos stay home as well if we ever get any. Good. Now, robots manage areas. I want to restrict. What's area one? Rename Robot Area. But why can't I select that now? I oh, didn't want to do that. Why can't I select that 
area. Hmm. Well, I'm going to restrict you all to home anyway. Does it have to be an animal area? Ah, it does. Robots count as animal areas. Right, so... Okay, robot area 1. And you're all going to be restricted to that. No, you're not. That one. And then it's pretty much going to map like for like the um, cleaning area. Although I'm just going to push it out just in case we get a builder bot and the walls need doing. There's that one. There we go. Uh, oh, wrong button. And then... I'm going to have to trim some of this back because I've just overshot it massively. There we are. Clear allowed areas. Robot area 1. Trim that back. Where else did I overshoot here? Excellent. So the robots now, we shouldn't have to keep recalling them and stuff. And in fact, actually, even better, if I don't even let them into the gauntlet, should be even better still. Cool. Did I reactivate that? There we go. Cool. Bring right. We are making progress. Still got some carpets to lay. Still got some slate flagstones to lay. Grain stores looking good. One sand hauling steel, carrying steel. Okay. Uh, need slate blocks. So golly gosh, what are you doing, mate? I'm doing that. No, come and uh, come and do some of this. So that's low priority. Oh, did I? Oh, wicked. Elephants are hauling it in. So that sorts that out. So one sign consuming fruit. Come and make these doors because I want to see whether the grain store uh, is at a sensible temperature. doing? You eating again? Oh no, you're going to bed. Hmm, okay, fair enough. Fair enough. So we are getting there, it's just sort of slow admin, uh, get it all sorted at the moment. Do another couple of minutes and then we'll put a cut in, I think. That sounds like a good idea. 
Bulk Goods Trader. Cool, one son, you're going to go and give them a shout as soon as you're up and about. you are. So go and give them a shout first before breakfast. And I don't want that blooming squirrel. No one wants a squirrel. Uh, pigs, yeah, elephants, yeah, I don't really want to get rid of any of them. Um, steel I want. Wow, he's got loads. So we'll just get a chunk of them. We'll get you components. Don't want the wake up. And get rid of them. Which gets us tons of money. We can get rid of a load of this apparel. I mean, the thing is, the things people aren't wearing, I should really get rid of as well, but. So, I mean, I, I will start getting rid of some of that. Well, assuming there's stuff I can buy, which there isn't really. I mean, I can get a load of gold, I suppose. Get some trousers, gas mask. Hmm. All the dead man's stuff gone. I suppose I could get all the steel. I can afford it. And all your meds, because I need some of them. Apparently, I haven't got any meds. Um, and yeah, and that gets us a few pennies as well. Do a one to get some more pennies. No, I think that'll do. That'll do. That'll do, pig. That'll do. I could do with getting another one of these here so I can get rid of some of that stuff right straight away. Urgent haul on those. So yeah, we got loads of silver now. In fact, one son, can you come and work on this trade station? And then we might even get in quick enough to sell all of that. Will do if you could carry more stuff at once. And that's made. So come back and call these guys again. We might get some more money and get rid of all this stuff. Yes. Marble shield, don't really want them. Dead man's, dead man's. Poor, poor. Degraded. 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 Oh, no, keep that. Don't know why, but we'll keep it. Uh, dead man's, dead man's. Dead man's. Cool. Well, doesn't get us a lot more money, but uh, I feel better about all that being gone. Yeah. Fin can we finish your job? Half a job. No, come and finish the job. Come and finish the job. 
Come and finish the job. Stop going and doing other things. Go and finish the job. Come and finish the job. Oh my gosh. Come and finish the job. Kicks her off the job every time someone walks past. Come and finish the job. Hallelujah. Alright, we've still got that door to do and then this is all fully indoors then. Get in there. Not got much in the way of meals, but Char's on the case. Dehydrating fruit at the moment. I'd feel better if mm, you were cooking at the stove. So, cooking at the electric stove, that's, I'm going to prioritise that for sure then. So, oh god, the writing's so small! Cooking meals at campfire. Make soylent. Cooking meals at stove. Two. It's worth it because we're getting some fine meals. Lovely. Which I think you then just went and fed to an animal after all that. The animals have got food! Mushroom has died from rotting. Why did it die from rotting? You know what, I'm going to harvest this, because I want to see what it's, what it's like, and where it goes in the food store and stuff like that, hey. whether it's got any decent uh, nutrition and all that sort of jazz. Golly, you're up. Filling barrels, nope, come and cut stone. That needs doing. Can't do anything else without that. Well, boar self tamed. Okay. Right, well, this episode's gone on too long anyway, so we'll put a cut in here. And uh, it looks like we're getting better now. We're getting back up to strength. Um, so what are we going to do next time? Well, we've got no more real outposts in range. There's one up here, which is the actual Wild Rats faction. That could be really heavily defended there. Um... Oh, and there's another one there. They've got two. So I am quite wary about going and smashing that. And it's going to be quite hard to get to. I mean, if we... If we were to go there... 3.7 days... Uh or this one is 3.7 days as well so it's an 8 so yeah we would need a lot of food to do that 
because we're going to be taking a lot of guys if you're taking out a faction. So we'll see. We'll have a look. We'll see what we're going to do. Uh, but I will see you next time.